Y'all like my new wig? <laughs> I feel like a Puerto Rican. A bitty bitty mama. <laughs> if y'all don't know what that's from, then I don't know what to tell you. So today we are going to be doing a wig customization video because this is not how this wig came out the box. It, it, it really isn't. Just look at this, girl. She looks good. She looks really Anyway, if you guys want to see all the information about this wig and see what I did to it to make it look like this, stay tuned, okay? Because it's coming up right after the break. But before we go, let's have a chat. Look how cute I am. Look at this wig. Look at this beat. Don't you want to be, like, hooked in to all of that? Like, all the time? So do me a favor. Click the subscription button. Click the notification bell. You can become part of the most glamorous, the most fabulous community here on YouTube, the Glam Fam, and know exactly when I upload, okay? I got a lot of great content that's up already, and I got a lot of more great content to come, so make sure you do that, okay? And without further ado, let's get into this wig. Oh, my God. She's so cute. I shall name her Isabel. Oh, oh, oh. Why are you slowing down? Oh, it's in traffic? Break lines, red lights, hold hands, grip tight. What's up, y'all? Anyway, look, I'm sorry that this is like this, but I waited all day to film, and now it's nighttime. <laughs> and I said I want to get this video out this week. So, I was like, if you want to get it out this week, then you need to do the filming part today and then do the installing part the next day okay so we're gonna try and do that excuse my looks right now it's been a long day and um i've been home so i just look crazy and excuse the glare is that better that's better so the wig that i'm talking to you guys about today is the relique 12a grade 4x4 deep wave lace closure wig and I got it from Amazon. So it shipped in two days, as you know, cause I got Prime. Um, I paid $126.88 um, for the wig. It was $138.62 with um, tax. Let's open it up. It came in just like the regular Amazon mail, you know the white ones? And then this is how it came in that mailer. I have already taken it out, but I put it back in so that I can take it out and unbox it for you right now, okay? So here goes. 28 inches of wig. Okay, so the wig that I had gotten, you know, the, the other one that we just did just a little while ago, that one was short. And so I said I wanted a long wig that is curly as well. So I did some research on local YouTube and I found this one and it was fairly inexpensive and it um, was curly like I like it. All right, so let's talk a little bit about the specs. Like I said, four by four closure, right? Um, it is, it looks just like regular brown lace. It's not like transparent lace or anything like that. So it's probably going to be some customization that we got to do with this. The knots are hella brolic. Like, can y'all see that? Can y'all see that? Can y'all see them knots? Look how, look how thick they are. So I guess that's good. Um, it has two combs on the side one in the back and then it has the adjustable straps just like every other um wig um and it's like i said 26 inches so i got this and i was like i was looking at it and i was like it looks thin and that makes sense because when you get um curly hair or when you get long hair rather the longer it gets the thinner it gets so because i thought it was too thin i bought this Deep Wave Human Hair Bundle from the Vera Vicky store on Amazon. And this is also 26 inches. And it's still a little bit thin, but I feel like adding just a little bit of hair to it, it will make it look really, really nice when you put it in. And it won't be like, you know, like them pew pew ends. Like, don't nobody want that. Like, look at these ends. You see how thick, nice and thick they are? I mean, they're not like, you see how like they just, yeah. I want them to look like that, you know? Um, so that it's not like, oh, that girl has hair and she need a trim. I don't want that. So I bought this extra bundle. And so we're going to put this in that hair today. And then we are going to bleach the knots. 
Then whenever I come back, we are going to install it after it dries. Okay, so now that I'm looking at this, after I like separated it, it looks really cute and like it's not gonna be too thin at all, but I'm still gonna put this extra bundle in because I did buy it and I like big hair. So here I am sectioning the hair so that I can add some tracks to this part of the hair. I added the entire bundle and it was about four different places that I added the hair. I'm doubling the weft so that it can go by really fast and like quick and easy. At first I did not do anything but just like double the wefts together but I realized that it was taking too long because I had to make sure that I had both of the wefts um, in the thread and so after this first bundle I started doubling the wefts and sewing them together before I installed it and it went by a whole lot quicker. Okay, we are back. I finished sewing in the entire bundle and as you can see, it is a lot fuller now, especially down at the bottom. This is going to be an amazing wig when I finish, okay? It's gonna be just like bomb, okay? Very, very good. I'm very excited. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to bleach the knots. All right, so let's 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 get to that. I have 30 volume developer. I have the Clairol BW powder. All right, y'all, so I left the bleach on for 45 minutes. And I set the, the intervals at every 10 minutes so I could go in and check. Um, but these bleach, like these knots were really, really like thick. Like, you could still see the knots. And that was after 45 minutes, but it was seeping through to the hair and I didn't want to get any like copper spots in the hair because I didn't feel like going back in and like dyeing it. So I was like, you know what? I'll just take it off. I will come back to you when I'm ready to install it and we'll see how it looks then, okay? Install in style. Okay guys, we are back. Let me pick up. I'm gonna show you her in all her glory, okay? Look at her, she is so cute. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. So what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to add an elastic band to it and then put it on and then we will shape it and see if we need like any extra styling, okay? All right, so I have my glue gun here, my elastic here, and we will get to work. So here I am just measuring my head to see how much elastic I need to cut off. I got the glue gun on there and I'm sticking the elastic on. I'm using a brush to kind of press it down and then I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the other side. And there we have it. I'm just going to put on my stocking cap and then put the wig on and just like fix it how it needs to be fixed so that it is nice and situated. I feel like a Puerto Rican. A bitty bitty mama. <laughs> if y'all don't know what that's from, then I don't know what to tell you. So I forgot to tint the lace before the wig came on my head, so I'm just doing that here and then adding some of the Wig Dealer Lace Melting Spray so that I can blow dry it and have this wig affixed to my scalp. So while we're waiting for the comb to heat up, I'm going to put in some light layers for this because the closure stops like right here and then the hair gets long and I don't like looking at that shelf. So I'm just going to thin out this so it looks a little bit more natural. Just a little bit. And I'm going to put down my wax stick and then use my pressing comb to press out the top. I don't want to like take out any of the curls. I just want the top to sit flatter on my scalp. Then I'm going to take some water and just lightly spritz it. I'm gonna concentrate it most on the ends and leave the middle like half wet because this will help create a bigger hair. And then I'm going to use my diffuser and the blow dryer to like half dry it. Now I'm going to cut off the lace. This thing is stuck to my head. And it's a little tough, but I got it done. 
After that, I'm going to put some concealer in the part to define it and then on the front of the lace to blend it into my skin and finish with some root touch-up spray. All right, y'all, we are done. We are finished. How do you like it? Mm, I like it a lot. I'm not even gonna lie. I like it a lot. This is really cute. This is very cute. I love the length, but this is gorgeous. Oh, look at the length. Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. Oh, this, this hair. I don't know, tell me what you guys think about it. How did I do? Does it look cute? I added a little bit of baby hair just because, you know, I feel like Isobel would have some baby hair. She's a, she's an Afro Latina. She's she's giving, she's giving, she's giving. I'm from Latin America. I'm from Panama with this. I'm from Belize. I'm from Costa Rica. Okay. <laughs> I'm just joking. Anyway, um, but yeah, tell me what you guys think about this. You like it? You like it? What do you guys think? We're done. We're done. Anyway, that's all I have for you guys today. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up down below. Liking this video is the least expensive and the easiest way to support this channel. Also, wig dealers, like wig people, come like holla at your girl. Like, look at this face. This face was made for wigs. This head was made for wigs. Right? Right. Oh, she looks amazing. So, like I said, liking this video is the easiest and the least expensive way to support this channel. I try really hard to give good content and it takes a lot of energy and a lot of time. And I would really like, we are growing like slowly but surely. I think we're like 1806, which is amazing to me. Um, but like, it just makes me so happy to see that we're growing. So we wanna keep growing, we wanna keep that. So spread the word around, tell your people to follow, tell your people to subscribe, okay? Click the subscription button and the notification bell so that you can be a part of the Glam Fam. Just make sure that you are tuned in, clicked on, like subscribed, notification bells on, so that you know when I do upload, when I do upload, okay? Also, don't forget to follow me on all major platforms at Glamazon1026, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.